Hi everyone! Today, Vegard has chosen not to show up for work. There's a Seamus Gorman company strike. Okay, I am joking. I am having a quick little jest, one would say. Sorry, I don't know, why, why did I speak like that? Um, okay, uh, this is weird without another human being in the room. No, okay, sorry, I keep going on tangents, I need to stay on topic. Today, I'm gonna be watching a movie without sound. Shh. <laughs> that could be like a bit, that could be like an intro. Like, watching a movie without sound. Shh. So yeah, I don't really know how else to say it other than that. I'm gonna watch a movie without listening to them. I'm just gonna see what's happening on screen, and then I'm going to try and work out what is happening in the movie without the sound. Then, Vegard is going to come into the video. Yay, Vegard's coming back. And I'm going to try and explain what happened in the movie to him without having heard anything from the movie. <laughs> I've seen a lot of movies, but I realize there's one type of movie that I, as a child and as an older child that some people would call an adult, but I have never really been into. Horror movies, because I'm a little scaredy cat. The movie I have decided to watch is hereditary. Oh, okay, okay, this is great. Text immediately, I can learn some stuff. Ellen died at 78 after a prolonged illness and her daughter Annie's house, April 3rd, 2018. Okay, so this is a funeral notice. That That is uh, what what is going on here. Already, this is a very slow opening. It's like panning in on things. I'm not even sure if it's real. It seems to be like a house within a house. Oh, and there's a person sleeping. Okay, I'm guessing this is Charlie. Or the other, I've already forgotten one of their names. This is Annie. Annie is like, like having a speech about her mum, like talking about how much she meant to her, like, mom, I love ya, you lived to 78, I'm gonna live longer than that. that that's what I'm guessing she's saying. I, <laughs> oh God, that is a dead woman. That, that is, that is a dead ass woman. Oh, and there's a guy smiling in the background. You know, I love people who smile at funerals. Every time I go to a funeral, I'm like, I'm gonna put the fun in funeral. And I'm just like cracking jokes like, Whenever <laughs> we were dying to get here, <laughs> I mean, the, the, the person who died was dying. You, you get, you get, you get the gist of it. Oh, they're back home. They're back home. Funeral over. So all the context I had has been used up. Oh my god, my back. How am I meant to sit up like this? Oh my god. Okay. Oh, she drew her dead grandmother in a coffin. That's kind of, kind of, kind of, kind of, kind of weird. I'm not gonna lie. Um, this is probably the, the the most difficult part to sit through because I have no idea what they're saying. And the end. And the end. Do I have the attention span to do this? Do you think this is a box of things from her grandmother? This is, the, okay, I think this is where the plot really gets set in motion. Okay, old book. You know that book is gonna have something in it that is just like weird. Oh my God, oh my God, no, she's rushing to close it. Oh no, I, I actually felt like a chill as she rushed to close that. Oh my God, if something, I, I would actually get hit by a jump scare right now. Like that would, that would get me. Oh my God, I'm actually scared. Oh no, I don't like this. This shouldn't be scary. I have no sound. Oh no, oh no, what are you looking at? No, oh no, 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 oh no. Oh, I don't like this. I mean, the first red flag is making miniature sculptures. The, who, anyone who does that, you are insane. Or like having like antique dolls or something. You know, like people like, of course you're gonna get stuck in a horror movie if you have like an Annabelle doll. Oh my God, what? Oh, no, don't, uh, uh, uh. Oh my God, what is wrong with you? That was, that was honestly, I, I don't even know if we can put that on YouTube. Did, and you put it in your pocket? I still don't really know uh, what the, the main evil is gonna be here. Um, but I, I have a feeling it's tied to the grandmother in some way. She's opening up about her mother, I believe. Yeah, she was great. But then I found this weird letter and now uh, my house is haunted and I, I don't really know what to do about that. Can you guys all relate to that? And they were like, I think you're in like the wrong meeting. Maybe you need to find like a mother died and haunted our house group. You know, find your own group, Judy. Whatever happens to this kid deserve, is deserved. Has he really brought his sister to the party? <laughs> I wouldn't be able to do that. That would be too embarrassing. Something is going on, but it's not good, like. Oh my God, no! Okay, so I don't know why I reacted like that. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my, did, did she just get just whacked in the face? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> did he kill her? <laughs> did he kill her? How, how do you explain that to your parents though, then? Yeah, I just, uh, I lost her. I, 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 she never came back from, from the party. Oh 
Oh my god. Oh, I. Oh, that's. Oh, that's actually so traumatic. I hate that that happened. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's so sad. Imagine actually doing that. Oh, he killed his sister. I feel bad. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, that, that, okay. Just straight cut to the funeral. Okay, but has he got away with it? Because he was driving under the influence. He's still just like getting on with his life. I, I would, I'd be inconsolable if I did what he did. I would never recover from that. I, that, I, that would live with me to my dying day. I have no idea who this character is and what they could be talking about. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 I do not need a jump scare right now. I do not need a jump scare. Oh no, you, oh, the, the camera work is like, it's still scary. They built it up, like even without the music and like the tension, you're still like expecting something to jump out. And I guess I'm gathering the lights are like, th there's something evil in the lights. Oh, it's the woman. Oh, that's the, Joanny. Okay, okay. Wait, no, I now know. Okay, I now know this woman character is called Joanny. No, I'm getting it. It's all piecing together. Okay, so this woman must be important in some way. Oh my god, she's making a diagram, look, she's making a miniature of her own daughter's beheading. What is wrong with this woman? I'm starting to think the, the main Annie, Annie is the problem. I even think he's calling her out, he's like, what are you doing, woman? Oh, they're just, they're just having a, a silent family dinner. Um, what do you guys think they're talking about? I, I think they're talking about how he killed their... The, the, their daughter. <laughs> I think the mum's like, yeah, well, she'd be here right now if it wasn't for you. And he's like, well, you're the one making weird miniature sculptures out of it and making us all relive it. It's your fault. Oh my god, they're actually having a big fight. Okay, no, I was just, I was just like playing, but no, they, they, she is like, she's actually mad at him. She's still going. She is still going. Oh my god, she's actually, is she, is she gonna turn into like a demogorgon? He's like, well, I wouldn't have had to drive her there if you didn't make me bring her. Do you think that's- I think that's probably what was brought up. I'm waiting for both of you to die too, and then I'll make your miniatures as well! <laughs> it's just not been her month. It really hasn't been a good month for her. Is that a, a chicken wing? Or like, drumstick? On- on the table? <laughs> They're having a seance with? <laughs> what is that? I can't actually tell. That was weird. I will admit, that was weird. I- I, I still don't really know who this Joanny woman is, but I'm pretty sure she is Satan himself. Uh, I, 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 are you still alive? Yes, you're still alive. Hi, I, hi, I'm here. Oh, is she gonna make them do a seance too? You need to listen to me. I spoke to her. She wrote, love you Grammy on a, on a, on a, on a, on a whiteboard, on a chalkboard. I, seriously, you've got to believe me. <laughs> They're like, oh my God, we just, let's just do it. Let's just get it, let's get it done with, okay? Yes, yes, destroy the miniature. Yes, that's what it's all about. That Oh, the, the miniatures were the problem. I think they're cured now. The, the, the demons are gone. The, the, it's all, everyone's happily ever after now. You see, I don't watch horror films. I don't like them. They make me scared. This is just unfair. I know this is like not even that scary because I can't, I don't know what's going on. But I still do not like it. Are you going to burn the book? Uh, no, don't burn. Okay, I feel like if you burn the book, that's a mistake. I just feel like... That decision is the wrong decision. Oh my God, Jesus Christ. What are you doing? Well, take the coat off. What, why? You are on fire. You, what? Okay, it's bright again. It's bright. It's bright outside. It's no longer in that dark room. You know what? Nothing bad can happen in a horror movie during the day. Let's just get on with the, the day and uh, forget that last night even happened. And successfully invoked. King Payman will possess most of so I'm guessing King Payman was using the grandmother as a host first, then took over the daughter. That's why she like chopped the head off of that, that pigeon. And then for some reason went into, to, to Joni. He's, he's like, do not get near the kid. I don't think he trusts her. Maybe he thinks she's the problem. Cause I would probably at this stage too. He's like, you put that up there. How else could anyone, I would blame her too actually at this stage. Cause like, how else would it have got up there? And she's like, she's like telling him and he's her insane ramblings. Like, no, you gotta look, look, look at like this Joni. And he's like, who's Joni? You never introduced me to Joni. You never even mentioned Joni before. Like, no, remember the person, the seance person? Well, she's in all of our old family photos. And he's like, 
Yeah, she's insane. I just want to say, I entirely get what is going on in this scene. She is like explaining everything she's learned through the course of the discoveries over this movie. And because she hasn't communicated with him at all up until this point, she just sounds insane. <laughs> and so he just doesn't believe her, I think. He, is he dead? Is he, That's him. He's done. He's done. She just killed him. Wow. That, that, I feel like that scene would have been way better with sound. <laughs> oh, thanks, Seamus. I don't like this. I imagine the music is so scary right now. I would be like curled up in a ball if, if the music was playing right now, because this is terrifying even without. Oh no, oh no, oh! Oh, that gave me the shivers. I do not like that one bit. Why is she there? What is she doing there? Oh no, oh, oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 I do, oh, I did not like that. Why can, oh God. Ah! <laughs> is the mum trying to kill him? Has the mum been possessed? This actress is fantastic. <laughs> but I do not like this. Oh my God, what are these? Oh my God, what, what is that? What is that? I just saw a bunch of like naked dead bodies. Is that the dead like ancestors throughout the family? Is this them trying to get him to become the next King Plato or whatever it was? Well, he's he's the King Plato now, I think. I don't I don't really know what that means though. What what is going on? What is something being said by someone off screen? Cuz this has just been a shot of him looking scared with a crown on his head for like a minute now. I, I thought I was understanding it for a bit. I thought like, I'm getting this. I'm getting this. There was obviously a lot I missed and um I didn't get as scared as I think I would have had I watched that with sound. Oh no. <laughs> now I'm going to try and explain what happened in the movie to Vegard. Everyone clap, Vegard is here. Vegard has arrived uh, on, this, on the set today. Vegard has made the conscious decision to be off screen because I always get, you know, I always get comments saying, uh, why do you not let Vegard on camera? And then I'm like, and, I, and I'm like, now Vegard is literally making the active decision to not be on camera. Okay, I'm in, I'm on camera for some of it. So, um, how familiar are you with the movie Hereditary? I've watched it. How, how, when, wait, so you watched Hereditary when it came out? No. I never said that. But yes, so I watched Hereditary, which, um, was- You did? You watched Hereditary? Sorry. <laughs> it was, uh, good. I liked it. Here is the story from my perspective, okay? Movie starts, grandmother, dead. They're at a funeral, okay? And some messed up kid starts drawing her grandmother in, in, in her notebook and like her dead boy, it was, that was weird. Then uh, also this messed up kid, who I did not like by the way, I was like, I really did not like this kid, started chopping heads off pigeons. And there was also like some like demon fire person that the, the, met the kids saw. I don't know what that was. That never made sense to me. But then that kid, deservedly so, got its head chopped off. That's when you screamed. <laughs> oh! What I couldn't work out is how the son got away with it all. What do you mean? He committed manslaughter. He was driving under the influence and killed someone who was in the passenger seat of his car. And he just yeah, got off scot-free. <laughs> then like the mum meets Joni who I think is a demon, but I, I, I've no way of proving it, but I believe she was a demon of some sort. And then they start doing all their Ouija board stuff and uh, start talking to the dead. And and her, the mum is weird. She's making like miniatures of her family death scenes and then makes a miniature of her son's death scene that hasn't even happened yet. That was weird. I, d I still don't really get what the minute, how the miniatures tied into the story though. Like that, that was lost on me if there was a reason there. After that, it just goes, it just turns into a different movie basically. They're, they're like summoning spirits from the undead. Uh, she starts having dreams about her son being eaten by ants. And then the mum kills the dad by accident, I think. But for whatever reason, her killing the dad also turns her into a demon and she becomes an evil demon after that. The son's like trying to get away because he's just survived the demon attack. And then the movie literally just ends with him becoming an Egyptian like emperor or something. I think you explained that pretty well from what I remember. <laughs> <laughs> so actually, watching a movie without sound, not that bad. In conclusion, watching a movie in silence is not actually as bad as I thought it would be. I feel like you notice some things that you maybe wouldn't have noticed before, but 
also you don't entirely get the plot of the movie. I don't think it's as enjoyable an experience. Wow, what a, a revelation, revolutionary discovery. 